Right, is everybody watching? Ten. Nine. I'll sell it. Oh no, it's doing the circular stream. It works! <laughs> it has ripped itself apart, so the ultimate test... We are going to go for the ultimate test and turn the air... Uh... It hasn't ripped itself apart, though, so... Oh. We've even got the piston running now. This is where it's okay. probably going to go wrong. I was sat right near those drills. And it, it shouldn't bad. walk out the track. The only way it can move is left and right. And we've already tested the piston, so it shouldn't be able to come out of that track. But you've got the, where the drills are going down. Friggin' out, this is actually gonna work, I think. <laughs> I can't believe I've, like, developed this idea. I really can't. Go on, lower it down, then. No, it's just, you got to test things first. Be just get it on the planet and rip it. It definitely would have gyros for that. There you go, I can see some sparks now, so obviously... That's because you got the movement below. I'm waiting for it to snap it off, but I really <laughs> am. <laughs> when this motor can't lift it back up. Well, the mo effectively, the motors are not affected by the amount of weight you got on them. That's what's good about that. down a bit now. <laughs> We're going to do the old oh test. You don't want that fully extended when you're trying to drill down, do you? You want to lower that gently. It is. Well, I well, not on my screen, it's not. <laughs> One minute. I'm trying to get into a better position to see this. That's hit rock. Yeah. I'm really laggy now. You will be, I suspect. I'm trying to bring it in so it drills. And then get this just right if I can on about point three. At the moment, I'm having to use the thrusters to go down because obviously I can't lock it in, guys. <laughs> like people are going, it's actually working. <laughs> it's drilling. I can't believe that is actually drilling with no gyros on there. I'm, I am astonished at that, guys. I'm not sure whether it's just on mine. Or whether something sounds like it's gone bang. Well, nothing's gone bang on mine. Not yet. <laughs> I can't believe that is actually working. <laughs> yeah, well, that's what I was saying, that it does... Obviously, when it's fully extended, drilling, you would need gyros to counter the movement. But effectively, I kind of want to get out and go down there, but I don't want to leave the ship unmanned. Because if it goes wrong... Effectively, I'm not even locked onto that planet. It's got enough weight to hold it there, by the looks of it. I'm actually astonished at that. You're not using... At all. No, I've just left it there, it's just sitting there. Obviously it's got dampers on, so it should hold it in place anyway, so if it moves... Because uh, it says it's doing 0 0.1 metres per second, and then it stops. So I think it is moving it, and then it's stopping it itself. But that is actually drilling down. It's 
still coming down guys we're only halfway into that hole <laughs> how full do you reckon those drills are going to be about now <laughs> oh mate we've got to find a way of locking it onto the asteroid though yeah I'll worry about that tomorrow <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't like to leave that unattended to drill away in there. Uh... No. Oh no, you definitely want to have it locked. People are like, that's fucking amazing! <laughs> Um, no, actually, Morobid, it shouldn't do that because of the fact I've put gravity, this is why I've built a large ship, is gravity on it, forcing the ore back into the hole so the drills will pick up more of the ore that drops back in the hole. So I've catered that in the design. We are sort of three quarters of the way down and it is sparking now quite good. <laughs> Which I kind of thought it might because of the amount of movement it's going to have down in that hole. That has dug a big hole though, guys. Wow. Are you going to like pull it out and let's see what we've got then? No, I'm going to wait Are for it to go. Gonna... It's got to go all the way, mate. <laughs> it's got to go all the way. I know it's tempting fate, but I'm, I'm hovering over the Y button so I can cut power at any time. So if it starts getting really bad, I can cut power, but I think it's sort of holding pretty good. It is starting to move a bit down the bottom, though. But like everybody's saying, gyros will stop that. Yeah, I got it set quite high, though, Princess. It's set 512 because I got a lot of memory, and it ain't lagging, so I think that's all right. We're gonna. It's gonna take us about six days to empty the drills out. <laughs> <laughs> We are getting some big cranes now. It sparks again, but I think that's all right. Were you drilling onto anything in particular, by the way? I don't know. I hadn't put the ore detector on. I just drilled a hole. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be fine. I'm just hoping it ain't gone through the ceiling and down into the cavern below. I can't see that. Right, well, we're at the bottom, so it's just got to come back up now, guys. Yeah, basically it's the object limit limits it, um, Robid. I used to. I just need, need to. I need to go get some energy. Cool. And then I'll go look in the cavern. I don't think you're going to see in the cavern. Oh, you don't. Yeah. From Let's underneath, if you mean? Yeah. Well, it's, yeah. Go, it's coming back up now, so. Yeah, I'm not going to try and get under the drill head. <laughs> the ship has moved up a little bit because of. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if it has actually. That is friggin' amazing, guys. That, just as I say that, Kelly said that as well. That is taking how many days has that taken me to work that out, though? Because like we were really trying to work out how the pivot thing was working yesterday and couldn't get it to work. I will do mate, it's going to go up to the top position and then I'm going to cut the rotor and the power and we're going to look how much damage we've got, which shouldn't be much hopefully, this is why I've made that piston out of heavy block so it can take a bit of damage and not like completely break hopefully I am going to cut out this video of this tomorrow morning and of this operating and it's going to go up on YouTube and I'm going to post it to the forum and say this is why we need a proper piston because <laughs> this is taking picking ages to build this and I think I'm going to get a lot of uh, a lot of comments over that I don't know what can I do for a design now for my next design because like how can I like supersede this with my next thing if you see what I mean <laughs> I 
Right, I'm just going into the cavern now. Okay, well, we're almost at the top, so we'll be able oh to pull it out of the hole. There is a big square hole. Is there? <laughs> it's gone right <laughs> I think, through! I think so. I wondered, is there a lot of stones on the floor now? I've got so much lag. It's unreal yeah. in here. It wouldn't surprise me. When we stop the drills, it should improve, I'm hoping. I'm just waiting for it to sort of get up to the top, guys. <laughs> they are loving it. Make it bigger. That's the Mark II. The Mark II is going to eat a whole <laughs> asteroid in one go. <laughs> Turn that yeah. Off. On my screen now, I'm inside the cavern. There's just big chunks of rock flying into space. Oh dear. <laughs> so effectively, we should be able to come down here. That should cut your lag a bit. Yeah, yeah. Wow, that's ridiculous. <laughs> that is a hole and a half. Wow! Now, I don't know whether I've got the right hole here. No, you haven't. This hasn't gone through, mate. There's a few bits of stone in here. Okay. And that has gone it... through a load of iron ore and everything. <laughs> they're, they're all going to the net. They have to go to the extreme, my viewers, don't they? Build it bigger and better. hundred drills. A thousand drills. <laughs> that right. doesn't say a hundred. Um... Where's my cockpit? Right, okay. I don't know if you can... No, I think you've got to go to the drills to look at the inventory, haven't you? Right, the lag's decided to kill me, but I haven't got a new ship. You'll be classed for that. It's hardly got any stone in them. I was expecting more, but which ones have picked the iron? So, the iron's that size, so we need to go around there. I think they've done it. It's probably hit the object limit. And there's wasted a lot. I probably if I turn that right up, it will pick up more. Hopefully, two point about two point six in some of these. It hasn't picked up as much as what I thought, but it does friggin' work. Right, mate, I'm off. I can't keep my eyes open. Right, mate, I shall catch you whenever. Can't be. I need to lift it out of the old though, guys. Let me get um, some iron in that one. There's quite a bit in. In there, User but disconnected from your channel. Not, I was expecting a lot more for the size of the hole. Um, well, I don't know where you are, but don't be um, too near it because I'm going to lift out the hole. Oh, hang on. Yeah, I'm flying back. I respawned in space oh. without a ship. Cool. I think there is a limit to how many of those small ships you can have. So I'm going to pull it out of the hole. Yeah, it wouldn't surprise me. I suppose it would make the game a bit too easy. Skooman, you, were... you missed it. This works. Skooman's just joined and you've missed the ultimate in drilling rigs. I'll tell you what. Would I be right in saying? Where the hell? We've lost, we've lost some of the bits on the thing. <laughs> We've lost a container, and there's a big chunk of uranium here where one of the reactors has disappeared. So, okay, they might not be in the best of places then. <laughs> yeah, we, we might have to move them slightly, or protect them somehow. Okay, so it might need a little bit of work. Because <laughs> if we had lost both of those, it would have just stopped. We could line the containers up at the side of those big blocks. Yeah, we can we can move them. Don't don't panic too much on that. Wow, that used two, uh, two uranium ingots to drill all that. I can't believe the the size of the.